Oh my gosh, guys, it's almost Christmas! Hey, what is up, guys? It is Sparkling Koala here, coming to you with another mod spotlight. And in this mod spotlight, I will be spotlighting the mod called the Christmas Festivities mod. Now what this mod does is it adds in all these cool different features and stuff into your game that have something to do with Christmas to get you in the Christmassy spirit. Now the first thing that I'm going to point out to you guys is that in every biome there has there is snow on the ground. So expect that. And also on the trees we've got white little particle not particles, white little dots on all the trees showing that there is snow in the trees. Also, if you go over to sugarcane, you can see this all up in here. And then on top of weeds, we've got white. And then also the thing that I noticed is that on doors, we've got a freaking wreath on there. Heck yeah. And then on the note block, we've got this. There might be more altered textures, but I have not seen any other than those. Alright, so the first couple things that we're going to go over are the new items that were put into the game. First of all, we've got the new candy logs and candy planks. I'll show you what these look like. These are spawned in the new dimension called the Kringle, which I will show you in a minute. Let's put those back. There's also a new type of ice blocks. We've got like the cobblestone looking ones. We've got the ice bricks and the other type of ice bricks. And that's what they look like. Pretty flippin' nice. I'm gonna stick those back up in there. That's what she said. Alright, now we've got the new type of plant called the mint. This is spawned in the Kringle also. So we've got this this type of thing. And if you hit the if you hit the plant, which is the mint, it will happen to do the same thing as the sugar cane. So it'll grow back up, but when you hit it, you will get the uh, mint seeds and the mint leaves out of it. You can get the mint leaves and craft the mint oil, which will eventually be used in the crafting recipe for candy, except they have not put that in yet, so... Yeah, and then we've got the crafting table for candy, which is not usable yet, but it looks very freaking cool, and it has a little glass sound when you break it, I just found out. And then we've got a candy cane, which you can eat, and it just looks freaking cool. Right next, we've got the candy beacon, which you put on there, and you use it to get out of the crinkle, crinkle dimension. We've also got new candy leaves, which are on the candy trees. Ooh, and this is one of my favorites. We got this fireplace, which you can put in your house, and that looks funny, which you can put in your house, and it really looks freaking awesome you can put like bars around it and yeah so the next thing we have is the frosted window pane which looks like so it's a little bit glitchy right now but it's probably gonna look really freaking cool in the future all right now we have the gold hook which is used to craft the ornaments which i'll show you in a minute then we have snowflakes which are used to craft and then we have the ice drill which if you come over here and destroy ice, it will act like a pickaxe with frost touch, no, silk touch. And so it will pick up the ice so you can craft the ice blocks and whatnot. Alright, so what else we have are ornaments. So I'm just going to show you what the black one looks like. You can put them on your trees and on your house and they look freaking awesome. They're in each, they're in all these different colors, which you just craft them by putting the dye on there. Right, and then we got all these different types of candy, which you can eat, but they do not have crafting recipes yet, like I mentioned before. And then those are all the crafting recipes, which I will get to later. Alright, now these two things are really cool. We've got the portal snow globe, and we have the regular snow globe. Now the regular snow globe, you can set down right here. I don't know why it's all glitchy right there. Let me set it down right here. And as you can see, if you look in there, it's got all the cool particle effects and whatnot all over the trees and it just looks really cool you could just put it on your on your mantle in your house and it just looks really cool now what we got here is the snow globe portal now what the snow globe portal does is if you stand next to it it will pretty much just like suck you in and what that does is it'll take you to the Kringle dimension so we are going to do that right now 
So, uh, there we go. And we are teleporting to the Kringle Dimension. And look at that awesomeness of a tree. That looks so cool. Right, and then we've got the random little, uh, these things going on here. Also, the creeper now is a little bit different. Let's get the spawn egg up in here. If you spawn the creeper, it looks like a freaking candy cane. Looks so cool. And when it blows up, boom, blow up some blocks. But it will also drop candy canes, as you can see in my hand. Really, really cool. All right, and as you can see, we've got the trees up in here. Really nice. And that is the crinkle dimension for you. It snows constantly. We've got this stacking snow, which I think is really cool. As you can see, I break that, and then it has snow on top of it. There are different layers. I think that is really cool. All right, and how you get out of the Kringle dimension is you get the the Kringle, uh, not the Kringle, the candy beacon, which you get the candy beacon, and you set it on the ground. It'll make a little beam, which I think looks really awesome. You step in it and you fly in the air and it will teleport you back in a second or two. Let's go. Tele there we go. Downloading terrain. Download the terrain already. Glitching. Glitching. Why am I glitching? All right, we are back. Sorry about that glitch. I don't know what happened, but let's go ahead and get to the crafting recipes up in here. Alright, so we've got the red candy and the white candy. You put it together like this. That will give you the candy cane. Then you get a regular empty glass bottle and a mint leaf. That will give you mint oil. Next, this is how you craft the ice drill and the snowflake. This is how you craft the diamond snowflake. This is how you craft the regular snow globe. And this is how you craft the portal snow globe. Which, as you may notice... It needs the diamond snowflake instead of the regular snowflake. And then this is how you craft a regular ornament. You've got to have that gold hook. And then this is how you craft a different color ornament. You just have to have any type of dye. Like I showed you over here, you can have all these different types of ornaments. You just have to put in the different dyes. Crap, where's the next chest? Here it is, okay. This is how you craft a candy log if you want to do that. You might as well just go into the other the other dimension, the Kringle, to get the logs. But if you want to get a candy cane, all you do is put the log into the crafting table and you get a candy cane. Alright, now if you want to get candy planks, all you have to do is put these four candy logs together and you will get one candy plank. And this is how you craft the fireplace. you got to have three nether rack. Two iron bars and a flint and steel. Now, lastly, we have the frosted window pane. You just got to put the four window panes, glass pane, sorry, and an ice in the middle. So, yeah, that is pretty much it for this mod, guys. If you like the mod and you would like to download the mod for yourself, the link to the forums page will be in the description. As always, if you liked my video, then please like the video. If you did not like my video, then please do not like the video. If you could, please subscribe to my channel and join the Koala Army. I would always love to have another Koala in my Koala Army. So I will see you guys later. Goodbye. And Merry Christmas!